curious about, for you, your strategies and process for setting your goals you know, on a day-to-day -day basis and, and how you're structuring your workouts and how you approach that workout for what you want to achieve on that day and communicating that with your staff, with your athletes, with your cops, and, um, so that you're, you're getting as close to that goal as you can in that session. Yeah, I mean, what you, you're just, again, you're just covered it. I mean, the reality is, or not the reality, what you want to do is everybody has to be on the same page. The athletes have to know exactly what the objectives are of a particular training cycle. Uh, not that they vary enormously. They have to be aware of that. They have to be aware of co collectively the overall pattern of the stroke. In other words, what we're looking for. And then individually, uh, they need to be aware. You have to communicate, talk with them about what they need to do to bring those changes forward, whether they be physiological or whether they be uh, biomechanical. Uh, so the communication is essential. It doesn't have to be a mystery. You, know, you don't want to have mysteries out there. You want it to be very clear what's wanted and needed. And you have to be very clear, and they have to understand, and actually they regulate that when they're on the water, uh, this is when the race is won. So this is not, it might be six months from race day, but the, but the fact is, this is when the race is won. The race is not won on race day. I mean, all coaches know that, most athletes probably know that. But I think given the complexity of, let's say, a university student's life, with their academic world, their social world, and, you know, so forth and so on. I think it's very, very important uh, to have them not only know what the objectives are, overview, but to know that today is a day, and this practice is a practice, that when it's complete, you're more developed than when you shoved off an hour and a half ago. So that, that, that has to be our functioning mindset or reality. And uh, it's not abstract, it's real. And of course, on the water, uh, when a squad is developed, uh, there doesn't need to be a whole lot of prodding from the launch. In other words, they want to be on the victory stand. That's sort of ingrained in them and they, they know and they endeavor to do each stroke what's required to, to bring them there. And then from time to time, you know, from the launch, you know, uh, at the appropriate times, you're going to be working on a, a particular portion of the stroke with an individual uh, and, you know, just bring clarity to, uh, to the uh, the overall process. So it has to be it has to be really a very clear communication. And there has to be a, there has to be a complete there has to be an absolute urgency. Not tightness, not anxiousness, but an urgency to get the work done.